I'll do the best I can to explain the assembly of this sequential burr. Oops. Starting with this piece. And which side? I guess I'll start with the side that has this small nick that comes together. And this piece threads into that... Oops. It's hard to do because the other pieces aren't there to stabilize it, but try to thread it into that nick. And if it's aligned correctly, it will come out at the other end. However, notice I put it in the wrong way first, so we have to withdraw it. Turn it around. And try again. So once again it comes out at the other end forming a continuation of the existing surface. This end forms a continuation of that surface. So I'll try again, or try to continue with this piece, which feeds into the big gap. And when I thread it in, it tends to push this other piece out of alignment, so I have to work it back and forth there. Hold that with my finger so the new piece can go in until it's lined there. But I put it in the wrong way so at this end there's a gap here and a second gap here instead of a single gap. And at this end this opening is the wrong shape. So once again I have to push it back the way it came. Turn it around, and push it in again while still paying attention that this second piece from earlier stays where it was intended to be, until it's neatly aligned. And this time there's a single opening at this end, and a single opening left at this end. So finally I can put in the last piece. And this one doesn't matter which one goes in first. So long as I can grip it, it's kind of slippery. And it slides right into the opening.